There's a weird flavor to it. Like a truck flavor. Like you could taste a truck. All right, so today we are trying some hot Cheeto carne asada fries. Hot Cheeto burrito. And of course, you know us, some birria tacos from this taco truck that we've been trying to try for Ever. <laughs> a couple weeks now. And when I say a couple weeks, like not literally every day of the week, because we only have like the weekends where we can really film like this. But for a couple weeks on the weekend, we've been trying to do this and they have not been here on the spot that they say, or like their hours have been weird and like, it's confusing. They've been here every other day when we weren't even gonna do a video for it. And then once we're like, let's do a video, they weren't here. <laughs> Ever. Yeah, so, but they're here now. There they are. So, we we're trying it. Let's go get the food. All right, so we're back with the food, right here, back home. The good thing is the food didn't have to sit super long. So it's definitely not soggy and it's definitely still fresh. Hopefully. And I'm glad they gave oh. us a lot of consomme for the burrito too. Tilted, oh yeah. Woo! And I think this is only a dollar and that's a lot. Yeah. Okay, so like we said, we got the hot Cheeto burrito with birria. Yeah, we decided to get the birria. I don't, I don't know what kind of meat to get. Because we already got the asada on the fries. Yeah, and we could have got chicken, but I don't know. The hot Cheeto, the chick, I don't know. All right, so let's check this out. So we got fries here, I'm assuming. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Right there. Look at that. Boom. That looks really good on camera. This must be the tacos. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's different. What is this? Oh, they're soft. Oh, they're open faced rather than. Oh no, this is much different. All right, and then we got that. So. Oh, that's cheesy. Oh wow, burrito, it's pretty big. Super big. All right, so I think we try the fries first because it's probably what's gonna get soggy first. Yeah. All right, so we got this. We got some sauces over there. Okay, you go first. Looks like they put like some special sauce in here or something. It's like that sauce yeah. or something. Okay, so we gotta get a little bit of everything. We got the fry fry. I'm so hungry. Oh, these Cheetos are soggy, soggy. Oh yeah, that's gonna happen. You know that's gonna happen. You're gonna hate that. Now I got a bit of everything. All right, go. It's super soggy? Yeah, there's no crunch really. All right, let's see. There's a weird flavor to it. Like a truck flavor. Like you could taste a truck. You know what I mean? Mm -mm. Chicken wing? Never tasted a truck. <laughs> I like it. Okay. There's nothing crazy, like amazing, but it, I don't. I mean, it can't be good to you if you taste like you're tasting the truck. Think it would have been better with just dust? I thought that's what the burrito was gonna be, because when I heard hot Cheeto burrito, I thought it was gonna be covered in Cheeto dust, not Cheetos in the burrito. We messed up. What we should have done was bought hot Cheetos and got our own dust. Mm -hmm. We can always try that at home, you know? I'm saying, bought our own. No, like the whole thing, like you make the burrito, dust oh, yeah. it, try it. I'm actually really enjoying this though, even still. Even still. I do want to try these though, and just see how they taste by themselves. I'm gonna try and dip this in the consomme, just to see how it tastes. That's good. No spice to it at all. I think that, yeah. Oh wait, not very spice, a little bit. I mean, yeah, th those are good. Let's try that. I don't know what that is. I don't know what's in that. It's pretty good. And the one thing I like about that meat is it's not fatty. Yeah, it's pretty good. What does it taste like? It tastes like that orange sauce, but better. You think so? I, yeah. don't know what the, I don't know what was in that orange sauce though. That's what I'm saying, like, what do you think it tastes like? Mm, I can't tell. Ooh, that green one's spicy. There's so much flavor going on. And that's the one thing with this, like there's so much flavor. It doesn't lack. I wish it was more sour, I know you don't like sour cream, but I wish it was more sour cream and more sauce. I mean, they gave us this sauce, but I don't know. All right, let's try these, let's try these though. We both, ah, oh, I forgot. There's so many onions. I'm not an onion fan. Not a fan of the onion. I'm an onion stan. Let's bring this closer. There's so much. I, I think I need to just redo it. You think? If you want to. Like, I think I need to just redo it myself, which is fine. It's not. It's not too bad. Not too bad, I you know. Yeah, I don't like the meat. I mean, the, I like the meat. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the onions, but uh, you know, sometimes you gotta work with, work with your food. Lime got good juice in it. I love me some lime. Love it. With consomme or without? No, with, because these are so tiny, we, we can't even waste it. We gotta go with. Dunkaroo. I like how they seasoned it too with cilantro. Oh, my meat almost fell. Oh, there's onions inside here. 
I was going to say, I didn't think I'd seen any. Mmm. I don't know if you guys seen that. Mmm. Like it? So good. Really? Mm-hmm. This? Or like the whole thing? I don't know. All of it. It is good though. I'm mad, kind of, that these are so small. No cheese. And we only have two. <laughs> I want more. But yeah, I got this thing soaked the first time. You're literally invading all of my space. All right. <laughs> it's pretty good. Those are a little too crispy for me though. Yeah. The thing with these is they're in the middle and I don't like the middle. Either make them soft or make them crunchy. Mm -hmm. It's like in the middle where it's kind of stale feeling. It's like soft in the middle and the corners are stale. But flavor wise is good though. Mm -hmm. Flavor wise is good. I was gonna say that about the soda in there. Like it looks a little burned, but that's how I like it. I mean, you can never go wrong with Mexican food. Mm -hmm. I mean like when it comes to food, Mexico, top notch. Mm -hmm. They're definitely up there. Let us know down below. Like, what's your favorite type of food? Mexican food, Italian. Asian food's really big, Italian's really big. <gasps> All right, we gotta try that though. We gotta try that. Oh, that rice looks so good. Mexican Wait, there better not be onions in this. Cause this I can't, I cannot take out. Oh my God. Okay, I can't really tell. I don't know, it doesn't look like it. We're just gonna jump in though. Look at my hands. <laughs> this thing is so messy on the edges. All right, ready? Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. Mm. Yeah, there's onions in that. I won't be eating no more of that. Really? Mm-hmm. It's not too bad though. Hot! It's like because there's so much going on, it's not too bad. But I, I know they're in there. What do you think about that? I might try one more bite. It's spicy. It's good. What do you think? Mm-hmm. I don't even taste hot Cheeto. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I still think the tacos are better though. One thing I don't like about this, it's just super messy. Like they over packed it with the, the sauces so it got like on the outside. Mm -hmm. But it's fire though. All right, I'm gonna do this. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, just pour it right over, right here in this corner. I love how they gave us so much consomme. I didn't think they were gonna give us that much for only two tacos, but maybe because of the burrito. Mm -hmm. The hot cheeto gives it spice, but I don't like it in here because you can't even bite through it. That's how soggy it is, you know? And I don't think we mentioned this, but the place is fairly new. Mm -hmm. This year, right? Beginning of January. He has a cool little truck. It's funny because whenever we pass by the truck, I always read it as Wonka's, not Wonk's. Because <laughs> it reminded me of Willy Wonka. It's purple, you know? Yeah. I'm just glad we are finally able to try it. Because mm -hmm. I'm telling you, we've been trying to do this for a minute. <laughs> the only thing I don't like about food trucks is that they don't take card. <laughs> yeah. Like here they take cash. I think it was Venmo. <clears throat> it might have been Cash App, but I think it was Venmo or Zelle. And it took me a minute to figure out how to Zelle. <laughs> yeah. Like I've done it before, but I didn't know you already had a, you had to have the number already in your contacts. So we just watched the movie uh, Spiral. The new like Saw movie? What do you think of it? It was a little hard to watch at some parts, but I'm just a baby when it comes to stuff like that. When it comes to like removing parts of your body, even there weren't any insects in it, but if I'm just scrolling on TikTok, I sent him a video that involved cockroaches. I couldn't even look at it. I had to cover it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm a baby. Did you like it though? Yeah, it was good. I was fully into it the entire time. It never got boring. It was always interesting. Yeah, I liked it. I don't think I did really. Mm. I could tell. This wasn't as good to me. And I don't know if it's cause I'm getting tired of it. Like these crazy contraptions that are like killing people. But I just feel like it wasn't as creative with like, I don't know. I didn't care for Chris Rock in it too much. Like I didn't like to try to bring like comedic side to it. It just didn't work. Samuel Jacks, none of it worked for me. The one thing I didn't like about it is the voice of the yes, spiral guy. Yes, that too. That no. just threw me off. It wasn't creepy. It wasn't scary. It was kind of like squeaky and high pitched. Like yeah. different person for that man. Yeah. <laughs> different, whatever you want to call it. So overall, I think this place is pretty good though. I think I'm obviously excited that we finally got to try it. Mm -hmm. But like, what do you think overall? You think it's like, like you, would you go here again and try more stuff or try the same stuff? Yeah. All right, so before we go though, let's rate these things. Let's start with this. Those, I'd give the fries a seven. They were good, they weren't bad. Um, but like you were saying, I feel like it could be more saucy. Yeah, I think I'd go seven and a half. Yeah, I just wish like more sour cream, but yeah, more sauces and stuff. But I think it was good. All right, what do you think about the tacos? 
tacos were so good. I'm gonna give those like eight and a half, nine. For the tacos, I'd probably go. Actually, I'll say an eight. The tacos, I'd probably say like an eight as well. I think they're, well, the tacos, including this, mm -hmm. was an eight. I think, yeah, really good. Not the best. I still think the other taco truck we had was better. Uh, but it doesn't really, can't really compare the two because that was cheese and. It had more stuff. Yeah, it was just. And the format was different. Yeah. The burrito, I'd give it a seven and a half. I didn't really like the hot Cheetos in it because they got soggy quick and it was just hard to bite through for me. And I kind of just liked it without the hot Cheetos. I didn't need that spice. Yeah. For me, I think I'd probably have to give it like a, I might have to go eight as well. It's like, is the tacos. The reason why for me is like, you had the onions, but I can't, I didn't say no onion. Like, you know, we didn't say no onion. So they put onions. That's just my fault. Take the onions out though. I, I think it's still really good. Yeah. I didn't mind the hot Cheetos. Maybe the dust would have been a better way to do it, but I still think it was really good. I mm -hmm. would, I would get it again, minus the onions. And overall, I think this place was good though. Yeah. I think it was a success. And their meat is pretty good. Like there wasn't really that much fatty stuff. Yeah. Especially in the burrito. There was no fat at all. There was like a little bit of fat on the tacos, but mm -hmm. that's to be expected. Yeah. But I feel like normally if you get like meat, it's always fatty, super fatty. But anyways though, that's gonna be the video. If you enjoyed it, definitely leave a like. We appreciate that. Subscribe if you haven't already. And comment down below if you guys have ever had hot Cheetos in your burritos, your fries, let us know. And if you have, do you prefer the actual hot Cheetos inside or you know on the fries? Or do you prefer the dust? Because we haven't tried it with the dust yet. Maybe we can do it ourselves. Yeah. Because people like the cooking videos. We haven't done one in a long time. A long time. So maybe we can do that. But yeah, either way though, my name's Matt. My name's Nicole. This is Oakley, and that was a piece of us.